Hi all, welcome to this session. The objective of this session is uh, to check how to manually print a transfer order in SAP Warehouse Management. So we would be looking at um, how to do a manual printout. Now for that, I'm picking up a printout. Uh, I'm picking up a transfer order. So for that, I'm going to LT22. This is basically a report for transfer orders, storage type wise. So I'm just picking up uh, the transfer orders on the basis of my warehouse and I'm going in so now here I have a uh, lot many um, transfer orders so I'll pick up one any one transfer order now let me pick up with the multiple line items basically that will help us out to understand okay here this one four we have one two three four five so we have a couple of uh, items in transfer order four so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna pick up transfer order number four uh, so basically let me pick this up and then the transaction code uh, to manually print the transfer order is LT31 LT31 so here print transfer order so you can see that it has already picked up the transfer order number you need to pick up a print code so basically I'm picking up a print code and then I'm picking up a printer it could be LP01 or LOCL that is local printer or uh, SAP local printer uh, because there is no printer as such which is assigned to the IRS. So I'm picking up LP01 and then the spool code 01. Click on this print. Now basically you have many options here. So I just want the TO document to be printed. So I'm clicking on TO document and I would say print or control P. So let me click on this. So you can see here now we have got the message printing complete right so now how to check it or whether the printing is complete for that we need to go to this pool stroko sp01 this is the transaction code to go to uh, this pool to check so i'm going to sp01 now here it has already picked up my user id so i just have to execute this so you can see here it has picked up uh, the uh, spools so let me pick up one now you can see here that this is each and every item wise so it would have printed one two three four five six seven eight nine and ten so totally ten are there now if these are like individual item wise why this happened so let's go reason being here we have taken up the print code as one it is single print but you item now if you take multiple print per TO item so it's tool we will take 01 and then we will say print again the printing is done so let's do a refresh we should have one more right we have one more spool now so the most latest one is this now you can see here here you can see that it is all all the line items in one single TO print right so it depends on uh, what form and what print code you're picking up so uh, to do the configuration we have uh, print controls at the back end uh, for uh, how the document which document what form so all the all those things you can actually look at by following my videos on SAP WM uh, this is how the printing of the uh, manual printing of the TO is done I hope you enjoyed this session thank you for watching please do subscribe to our channel for more videos like this thank you so much